So Jonathan, joining us for the F3 isolation series, of course, this time, you're no stranger at all to F3, having competed in that championship in the past. You're known for your pace. And I think that comes across when you're racing in the sim as well. But looking at that pace and that smooth driving style that you've developed, that helped you to win last year the Autosport, BRDC Autosport Award for young drivers. Talk to me a little bit about that. Yeah, I mean, that was probably one of the highlights of my career so far. Um, you know, it was an incredibly tough procedure over the two days, you know, driving the Formula 2 car, the uh, Aston GT3 and the Ligier LMP3. You know, it was extremely hard against the other three contestants who are really, you know, high level um, in motorsport already and were extremely fast. So, and I think it was also just the amount of tension that was building throughout, you know, the whole process. You know, it went from uh, the 10 finalists to the four and then you did the couple of days um, at Silverstone Then you had that really long month wait until the Autosport Awards and it just kept building and building and building. And then when my name was sort of um, announced, it was just the best feeling. I can imagine. And that puts you into quite the Hall of Fame. When you look at who has previously won that award, David Coulthard was the first to actually um, be given that award. Looking through to now, most recently as well, amongst yourself, Lando Norris, George Russell. Lando's racing in this series as well. You're actually competing against him right now. Um, but I imagine you'd like to be competing against him in real life and pushing towards that Formula One. Yeah, I mean, I think that's what's pretty great about sim racing. And, you know, the opportunities that have come out of these, you know, racing leagues is the fact that you've got all the drivers across, you know, different specs of motorsport or every GTs, Formula One, IndyCar, whatever. You know, they're all on the same track, racing the exact same cars, the same setups. You know, it's just who, it is truly about who's, you know, the better driver. Um, you know, obviously it'd be great to be in Formula One, but I think the um, the goal at the minute is just progressing slowly um, and, you know, trying to become a professional racing driver. Listen, I wish you huge, huge success, Jonathan. Um, you know, really nice to be able to sit here now and watch the rest of your career unfold ahead of you. And hopefully in the next years, we will we'll see you right at the top, whether it be sports cars or Formula One across. Thank you.